Hello traders, Omar Berg here with Lifestyle. This is a quick video on a SIS and looking at the portfolio page to see what information it represents and how you can actually understand it and use it with your trading. So I currently have Assist open as you can see on the screen here. I'm in simulator mode. I'm using a simulated account of about $1 million and trading commodities foreign exchange and ETF simply in on the cross out on the cross and the uh, rules associated with it from a risk point of view is a maximum of 2% on any given trade but I'm only going up to 1% so even though I've set the uh, max rule as 2% I'm only putting on 1 so this is the open positions that you can see at the moment what uh, I would like to do is to get to the portfolio page simply click the portfolio button here and go to either closed or current but look I'm going to go through the current portfolio to see what information it represents for you. It's pretty simple to understand. Now the reason I'm showing in the simulator, this is the same for paper trading and live as well, uh, though I just want to explain the differences so you can put, put it in uh, together. First of all is your pie chart here and this representation of margin and what um, what is currently being used in different areas. So for example, I've got majority of my margin taken up in ETF. So um, you can see down here, it also displays these figures in, in data form. So margin, this is the total amount and that's the percentage of equity that's used in margin. You can see the breakdown here for futures and foreign exchange. Here in the, in the current position data box, we have a couple of different things to explain. So this first one, the first box is available funds to use. This is simply your account balance minus the margin in place. So basically your what cash is available for you to use to invest into new positions or into um, opportunities. Now where this figure is come from, if we go to the simulator, let me bring this up, and if we go into the accounts page, this is the current available funds uh, um, information which is listed here 777652 and that's where assist pulls this information so that's represented there and how do you use that you simply uh, that's your guide to let you know what portion of your account is an unused that you can either have as a buffer in cash or um, wh however you may to put to more margin on other trades this initial is what you started with the initial value of the current portfolio okay so it started at 999478 Profit is pretty straightforward, unrealized and realized. Now this graph is also a profit graph. This is of realized profit. So you can see over the last week since I've been doing these, a uh, couple of weeks rather, the um, realized profit hasn't been too well. I'm actually down 49.290. However, my unrealized P&L currently in open positions is greater than that. So I would actually be, if I closed out everything at market right now, I'd actually be in front by about um, 5k approximately. And so that's how you represent. This here is realized profit and loss, which means the uh, closed trades that have been successfully um, opened and closed through assist. And this here is your unrealized PL, which is based in uh, from the simulator. So very important to understand that because it can be a little bit deceiving if you look at this, but uh, that's not your balance of your account. That's just the track record of these open and closed positions. The margin, as already explained, is this is the data form of this chart. Risk is not margin. So risk is what currently stands to lose if everything goes against at this point. So you can see that the risk on my account um, of this value is currently this and that'll give you the percentage value of risk. So what your rules, your risk parameters are based on margin and open risk. So if I have a maximum risk on a portfolio of 20%, it'll cap me out there. And if I have a maximum margin risk of say 50, pardon me, margin limit of 50, then I wouldn't be able to put trades on when this exceeds 50%, which is pretty close. And that's just a precaution to make sure you do not overextend yourself into a leveraged instrument, which can then um, go against you. Current trades and play is pretty straightforward. This is just all your open positions and how they're performing. So you've got uh, the red ones obviously are a running unprofitable position at the moment and the green ones are all the profitable positions. So these are open orders, okay, sorry, open positions. If you wanted to have a look at your closed positions, that's when you now finish on this screen, go to the portfolio and have a look at the closed positions. So let's click on that now. 
Okay, so the closed positions, you can see here, I've got a bit of a loss. Okay, these are on the closed positions on Forex, that's where it's hit most, and commodities, and the, the, you can see here that the equity uh, graph is the exact same. However, um, it will give you the data here, trades, how many have taken, unprofitable and profitable. So you can see right now I've got... Uh, from a percentage point of view about 30% profitable. Now um, you got your total uh, profitability here. It's pretty straightforward looking at these these uh, summary figures. Okay, and, and you can see annualized returns and whatnot. This is only on closed positions. This does not include open positions. And that's why uh, I've got a running loss at the moment because the these are all based on closed positions. However, you did see that the unrealized has actually put me in ahead uh, and you can see that my if I go to the simulator my net liquid value is actually um, at where I started to so I'm not really um, forward too much but I'm not backwards at the same time which is good so that's an overview of the account portfolio part of assist and that's just a good uh, keep a record of the trades that you've placed and how it's all performing so um, there are other videos to learn how to use this either in the lifestyle members area or on the trading pits website so we suggest you look at them as well and happy trading